The North Side, the North Side Learning, Learning Center. Center. The Northside Learning Center teaches English as a second language to immigrant and refugee families recently arriving in Syracuse, New York. According to Yusuf Sewell, volunteer director, the center has two primary goals. Empower them, first of all with the language and then to be able to realize the American dream. Indeed, the individuals served by the Northside Learning Center appreciate the great opportunity to learn that is provided here. If I start school, they, they show me the way, they guide me. Like, they, they don't ha they give me money, but they help me a lot. Money is not important. Even you have five or ten, just you buy food or something like that, it's finished. But you have knowledge, you can use any time. They give you knowledge. Um, so the people who come there, they are indeed special both from their circumstances, but also because they have the desire to want to better themselves. And they come from a background that was very challenging, but yet they want to persevere and be successful. I work the, I mean, like, I work in the hotel mm -hmm. as a housekeeper. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm just a housekeeper. What is the it's really, really bad for me? So, I. I design myself, I'm, I must go to school to get a better job and better life. If I'm not going to school, it's, nothing, it's not different from my country. Even when I was in my country, I'm not working outside, I'm just stay home and I work out at home. It's like own business. And when I come to US, I don't have any business. I just work to some other place or some other people. I start school and then it's very good. Yeah. I'm very happy to be a student in this <laughs> I think the biggest thing about the Northside Learning Center that sets it apart from other places, um, other learning centers, is the love and enthusiasm for education and that people actually care to learn, want to learn, want to be there. You know, everybody's excited to be learning, everybody's excited to be reading, everyone's trying to raise their hand and shout for answers. I see it in the girls that we work with, the young kids that are there and the parents that are there that are saying thank you for helping me and my children. They appreciate what's going on. With the motivation they have to learn English, students at the Northside Learning Center develop the potential to achieve their goals. Right now, we have people from over 20 different countries. They will arrive having been in the United States for two days uh, and they show up at our door. So people are very recent arrivals to this country with very limited English. America is a land of opportunity uh, and uh, we believe that uh, to take advantage of that opportunity you have to have the command of the English language. Every day I'm talking. If you go to my job, I'm talking. Sometimes it's wrong. <laughs> so sometimes it's good, not bad. If you if I'm not talking, it's, it's no good. Before I'm a refugee. I will try, I will try, I will try, I will try, I will try to. After that, my language okay. Go to police. Uh huh. College, 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 after that, finish. Wow, I'm a big American. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because language is very important. We arrived here one year ago when we discovered the difficulties we are having in the language barrier. And we find out now, North Side Learning Center. Then we were admitted, me and my five children. We are really benefiting because my children now can at least understand, write, read, and do their homework. And they are assisted in the homework, they are helped here. And when they go back to school, they are given good results because they did their homework. Yeah. As the teachers say, told me, your children are really working hard. Because in the support of uh, North Side Learning Center, it could not be possible for them to really do hard. The Northside Learning Center makes it possible for their students 
to have an impact in the community. Some of the people that we have were professionals in their country and were displaced, uh, again, due to civil conflicts and unrest in their country. So we'd really like to get them on the track to get recertified, recredentialed in whatever profession they were at to pursue their dream once again, but in, in America. Me, I hope also to go to college level to sit for the exams so that they can help me to upgrade, um, to learn more so that I can at least progress. I was trained um, as a physician assistant. I took three years course in Somalia. I arrived as a refugee in Kenya in 1992. In the camp, I practiced my knowledge and I was in the camp clinic as a clinician, I, though I also get some uh, seminars to upgrade uh, my experience. And then I sit for the exam and I pass the exam and they told me now you can practice in the country. Since I was in Kenya, I was practicing. I was working in uh, clinics, uh, nursing homes, hospitals. 2009 I arrived here, and since then I didn't practice that. Yeah. I'd like to go back to medicine. The Northside Learning Center has been operating on small donations. To help their students achieve the American dream, they need your help. I think the Northside Learning Center is a wonderful place with a calm and caring environment, and all people are welcome. It's a great program that's running on a very bare bone budget, and I think the more support that they can get, the better um, the program's gonna run, and the more sustainable the program will be. And when someone donates money to us and writes a check to the Northside Learning Center, it's an investment in, in the future, uh, because the students are, are getting skills that they can use to either get a job, go on to other uh, educational opportunities or training, where you have a lot of people who rely on public assistance, once they have the skills and the confidence in themselves, they can go on and support themselves and not be a financial or other burden to the United States. So this is, this is a great reason for, for people to contribute to a window. Of course, we are students of now North Carolina Center. We need help, we need more knowledge, we need uh, more teachers, we need uh, more advices. Students here are refugees from other countries. What brought them here is for them to learn in the English language and others. That's what we can appeal so that we can at least catch up with our, this world we are here in America. For more information about the Northside Learning Center or to make a contribution, please visit their website www dot nslcsyr dot com.